Parallel Strand Lumber, or PSL, is a mass timber product that is made by bonding long wood strands together in parallel to form large billets, which can later easily be cut into smaller PSL elements. The most popular Parallel Strand Lumber product, Paralam, was first introduced in 1986 at Expo 86 in Vancouver, British Columbia. Weyerhaeuser, one of the world's largest forest product companies, which began in 1900, now produces Paralam and PSL beams, columns and headers to be used in housing and light commercial buildings. PSL offers more design flexibility, easier installation and an overall lower cost than many other traditional building materials. It can be made from any wood species, but Douglas fir, southern pine, western hemlock and yellow poplar are often chosen due to their strength and availability. The manufacturing process of PSL starts off by clipping wood veneers into long strands. The length to thickness ratio of these strands is around 300. The strands are coated with a phenol formaldehyde adhesive and then pressed into large billets whilst being cured with microwave radiation. This process ensures that PSL is highly uniform and free from natural defects such as knots or splits because these defects are dispersed throughout the strands or removed if too extreme. Apart from parallel strand lumber, we also have laminated strand lumber, which is basically the same product, but with a length to thickness ratio of 150 instead of 300. There are of course some pros and cons to the longer strands with parallel strand lumber. The longer strands better utilize wood's natural strength along the grain direction and require less adhesive for bonding them together. The longer strands are, however, more difficult to bond together without any voids or weak interfaces. They are also harder to align during manufacturing and are less effective at randomizing the defects throughout the element. PSL beams are available in various sizes, with most common thicknesses being 68, 89, 133 and 178 mm. The maximum depth of PSL elements is around 457 mm and the length is often limited to 20 m because of transportation constraints. PSL elements can be machined, stained and finished similarly to sawn timber. It is often sanded down after manufacturing to ensure precise dimensions and high quality appearance. The incredible uniformity of PSL elements makes it very reliable in any type of project. If you want to learn more about the different types of mass timber, follow the links in the description. And if you want to learn more about the role of mass timber as a whole, subscribe to this channel. Stay informed, stay inspired, Timber Talk.